<laughs> what is the act of passing gas out through your mouth called? When you pass gas out through your mouth, what is it called? Uh, the carb, uh, what do you call it? Carbon dioxide. <laughs> Hey, what's up, guys? My name is Layemi Fearless, and you're welcome once again to Paul TV's Trivia. So today we're asking people, do you, first of all, do you even know what your birthday suit is? If I ask you what's the color of your birthday suit, would you be telling me some Christmas cloth story or your five-year-old birthday story? Or do you know exactly what it is? And do you know the difference between dowry and bride price? Have you ever looked it up? <laughs> well, let's find out. Let's go shake some tables on the streets of Lagos. So, Afusat, between a mosquito and a bed bug, which one is a carnivorous animal? Mosquito. Why, why do you think so? Carnivorous animal. Huh? It seems I, I, I was taught in biology, and yes. I think a bed bug. Because of the name, I, be, I gave it away. Bird and bug is being combined. Okay, you, you, you got me on that one. I'll say mosquito. Which one is a carnivorous animal? None. Carnivorous skin. When is not lying? <laughs> please, none of the above. <laughs> they are not carnivorous at no, all, please. Don't, don't fall my hand. I'm, I'm serious, but um, no, 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 they are not carnivorous. See, I just know that they are both, they suck blood. They are not, they are not carnivorous, actually. It's actually more, um, I think it's suck blood, actually. Which one is carnivorous again? Carnivorous. <laughs> none. Carnivorous. But no, none of them is carnivorous. Yes. So what are they if they are not carnivorous? Uh, they are insects. So tell me now, what's the difference or similarity as the case may be between dowry and bride price? There is no difference. They are both the same thing. Dowry, bride price, they are the same thing. You are paying dowry, you are paying bride price. Is it because it's dowry? I mean, the real is there. That's why you are. <laughs> they are both the same thing. It's just, um, should I put it as, dowry is more like the advanced um, should I say, no, 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 that is more like the traditional term we use for, you know, what a man will pay whenever he's taking his wife traditionally. But bride price is it so she's the more modern language we use as per English. So, they're about the same thing actually. You're paying for a woman and that's it. They are the same. Dowry and bride price. Similarity, right? And bride price is the amount that is paid. Why dowry is what they call it. Like dowry is the name that you call it. Then bride price is the amount that is paid, the total amount that is paid. Okay, so let, let me give you uh, an example now. So can I use your, your can I use you as example? Yeah. Okay, so if we pay 15 million naira, that's a bride price for Afusat. Then the name of the activity itself is dowry. Yes. Oh, okay, okay. All right. What's the color of your birthday suit, Faith? Your birthday suit. What's the color? I don't actually have a birthday suit. You move around without a birthday suit. A bed suit is like a bikini, right? What's the color? I don't have a bikini. <laughs> Respect. What's the color of a bed suit? I don't have a bikini. <laughs> so both of you don't have bed suit? Yes. Okay, is it a color or the date? Because I don't. Okay, blue. Blue is your favorite color, yeah? Yeah. Not white. Why white? Because I like white. Mm, pink. You like pink. Why pink? Pink is my favorite color. My birthday suit. <laughs> I, I'm, I've never celebrated birthday before, so I don't think that. But if I would do, the color should actually be black or black or red, because I like those colors. Blue. Blue? Yeah. Blue. A lot of people like blue. What's the color of yours? Um, Your birthday suit. Birthday suit. I don't wear suit. I like it hot. I don't wear suit on my bed. Day. She mm. likes it hot. I like it hot. I don't wear suit on my bed. Day. If it's not a bodycon gown, a mini gown, or a play suit, jumpsuit, suit, okay. Maybe when I've got it to that CEO level, for now, man, hot, hot everywhere. Bomb, bomb, palash. What's the color of your sweat? When you, when you work and you sweat, what's the color of that sweat? It's colorless now. Faith? Translucent. Depends on the sweat. I don't know. I don't know the oh, color. Are there types of sweat? It depends on how you see this. I don't know. It depends on how dirty the person is. Uh, my sweat is colorless. No! It's colorless now! Victoria, come on. There, there has to be a color here. 
please, what's the color of your own sweat? I am the Aska, you're the Aski. What? No, you have to answer. I am the Aska, you're the Aski. What's the color of your sweat? The sweat does not have color now. Are you, are you, are you sure, girl? We are very sure. Okay, tell me, what is the act of releasing gas through your mouth? When you, what's it called? Bilge. Okay, cool, cool. That's, um, the cup, uh, what do you call it? Carbon dioxide. <laughs> So let's do this one. You know, Nigeria gained independence in 1960. Yeah. We became a republic in 1963. What's the difference? Okay, um, I think Nigeria gained independence in 1960. That is, um, that was when, okay, um, that was when we gained freedom from being, um, from being actually under the British people. You get, but we actually affected it more in 1963. Like we became much more independent because, and at that time too, we still we still had the British colonies under us from that 1960 to 1963. But 1963, we, we we gained our full like freedom. We started like administrating things on our own more. 1963. 1960, yes, we became independent. Then 1963, we became one. Like I think there was now a separation of. Um, um, tribe like okay, Ibo, Yoruba, all this kind of thing. So, yeah, I think that's like the elaborate thing of what she said. <laughs> What's the difference? Um, the year into about 1963 and 1963 years different. Okay, what's the difference between mineral and soft drink? Mineral, soft drink. A mineral is a name of a soft drink. Why soft drink is a brand name? Like, mineral is like Fanta, yeah. Then, soft drink is the is the name that is called. Like, so Coke is the soft drink. The content inside is the mineral. Yeah. Mineral and soft drink. Are they not the same? They are. Take that, I'll take that. What's the difference between mineral and soft drink? Mm, let's say mineral has, a, mineral has a kind of taste. But soft drink, they are just they are the same. I would say they are the same. Uh, mineral is like a generalized word for soft drink, but they actually mean the same thing. Cool and then um, soft, drink. soft drink, your Coke, your Fanta, I don't know. <laughs> In the main meaning, like the actual meaning, mineral, this is what like natural resources like the, if you are, don't, don't come and give me X on my face, so if it is mineral, Okay, like you know, we have coal, we have um, gold, and all that. For me, that's mineral. Then soft drinks are drinks that you take that do not have alcohol. You get so that's my own definition, pure dictionary definition, and pure. Okay. People call soft drink mineral, okay. which is I want to buy mineral. I want to buy mineral. Okay. We actually have to. <laughs> but like she said, uh, mineral has under meaning okay, like coal and the rest. Okay. But then in Lagos, so people call soft drink mineral. So which side are you on? Lagos side or your own side? Soft drink. But well, no, me, I actually call it mineral. So let us, we all make the mistake. <laughs> well, it is with a heavy heart that I announce to you that not a lot of people know what birthday suit is. I, I kind of had that feeling to happen and it did. Anyway, no problem. But there's consolation in the fact that you know the difference between mineral and soft drink. Well, I hope you had a great time on Paul's TV's trivia today. Until next time, when we show up around your area, my name is Liam Fearless. Well, be ready for us when we do.